What's going on budget fam? Welcome back to another video. As you can see today out in the wild doing some hunting. Had a little bit of a score. Got some cards from Barnes and Noble. Picked up these two hanger boxes of update 2021. Um, love the, I mean, first thing is love the pricing at Barnes and Noble. By far the best prices on cards uh, out of anywhere. And it makes it just, it's kind of interesting that uh, you know, a lot of people are blaming Tops and blaming Panini, but it seems like it's really coming down to Walmart and Target with a lot of these price in uh, increases because stuff is just generally cheaper at Barnes and Noble. These were $9.99 plus the discount at Barnes and Noble, so less than $20 out the door for two of these. I had a lot of luck, or I guess, I don't know. I want to see if I was just lucky with my first two hanger boxes since they were really solid. And uh, so far, I've, I've had a lot of luck with update series. So I want to open a few more and just get kind of a better feel for it. Looking forward to finding some uh, blasters. If I don't find some and post a video before I post this one, um, blasters and monster boxes, um, just to get a feel for all the formats. But I wanted to try two of these just to see if these hanger boxes really are that good because the first two I got were outstanding. So. A lot of cards to get through. I'm not going to take too much time here with the intro. Some of my intros are a little longer than others. As you just know. I start talking then can't stop. But that's what I like. I like talking about cards. That's why I started a YouTube channel about cards. So. Always so loud. So a ton of cards in these 67 cards. No, like, exclusive parallels or anything. For the most part, with flagships, they don't do that type of stuff. There is a chance at autographs or relics, but I've personally never seen an autograph or relic pulled out of a hanger box. I'm sure it happens, but chances of that are very slim. Um, I like the, uh, the 92. Was it 92 or 91? I don't know for sure. Um, inserts. And uh, there's a good amount of rookies in these. So they've been a lot of fun, as far as I'm concerned. So, haven't pulled a lot of chrome cards out of these, though. Seems to be able to pull some really sweet chrome cards. I have not had such luck. Maybe I need to dive into the blasters a little bit to get some chrome card action. But here we go, starting off with a rookie, of course. And another one here, rookie debut, Andrew Vaughn. I've been hitting these like crazy. Akil Badu, those are always back to back. Kyra Ruiz, debut. Here's our first non rookie, Zach Collins. Selgar, uh, Daniel Lynch, Hunter Renfro, the other Hunter Renfro. Alex Vasia. Uh, these are a little bit kind of stuck together. Patrick Weibel, I've never. Had newer cards like this stuck together like this. They are a little sticky. Come on. Now. Yeah, this is weird. Marcus Simeon, Castro, Gonzalez, Wisdom, Gonzalez, rookie debut, Ryan Weathers. Interesting, these are kind of like stuck together. I've never. Uh, Jorge Guzman. It's not like they're like ripping, it's just the friction is kind of weird. Rosenthal, Ian Anderson, rookie debut. Cahill, the no no bath. Trevor, <laughs> no no bath. I don't, that's just, <laughs> that does not sound appealing. Jonathan India, nice. this is my first Jonathan India, uh, rookie debut. Very nice. Snowmaker or Shoemaker? Snowmaker. Oh, backwards card. We got a green or orange, maybe. Out of $4.99. Green. It's a rookie, too. Ben. Worth. Worth. Oh, man. I'm sorry, Ben. I'm not even going to try to butcher your name, but man. That's nice, though. Nice rookie numbered card. Love these parallels this year, man. Like the 
kind of like cracked ice type of look going on. I'm definitely feeling these. Beautiful. Digging it. Very nice. And another rookie, Andrew Vaughn with the 40 years of top. So obviously that's got to be uh, 91. 86, Nelson Cruz. Arenado. Juan Soto. Bo Bichette. Some nice ones out of this. And, ooh, that's pretty sweet. Brian Hayes. Like that. That's a winner. Joe Kelly. Rookie debut, Casey Mize. And going way back to Series 1 with that one. Jazz Chisholm, rookie debut. Doing really, there's a lot of rookies in this set, so it's seems like they're just flying out of these rookie debut. Evan White, this is the most rookie debuts I've got. I didn't get a lot in my last couple opening. Another Ben Rare, Ben Rookie. Luke Rayleigh. Um, Logan Gilbert rookie. So a lot of cards, a lot of base cards, but a ton of rookies. As you can see, ooh, nice snowy one, Snow Tigers. Alex Kirloff debut. So his regular card is a sideways or landscape card, and so is his debut. Billy Hamilton. Colts. Chris Gittens, rookie. Uh -huh. Cool. So this is going to be base card. See if there's any rookies in here. Um, Hirokazu. Saramura. Sor Tyler Stevenson debut. And a couple base cards there. All right. That took way too long. The card was just like, for whatever reason, just kind of stuck together. Like, not sticky, but there's like a little bit of extra friction on them. All right, there we go. Split the deck. Pool holes there. Debut of Scooball. Nice Jonathan India, not the debut. It looks a lot like a debut though. Uh, Floral, debut, or Floreal. Lindor, nice Mercedes here, rookie. Good looking rookie, Kellenic debut. So, man, hitting all the rookies, which is nice. Like you really don't even need to <laughs> Hey, for a blaster box, man, these you, these have you covered for sure. Nick Matson, Nathan, I'll probably try at least one or two blaster boxes in the monster box, but between the four Will Vest uh, hanger boxes that I've opened, I'm pretty sure I could probably complete the set at this point. Uh, Zen Attendee, Arihara, Rookie. Blankenhorn, Travis Blankenhorn. So, still a, another good round of rookies there. That's a Cronenworth and uh, it's like Tatis probably. So here comes the interesting stuff, Liam Hendricks, and then we have a backwards card. It is numbered, so it's a gold of Brad Miller. Brad to the bone. Nice Brad Miller gold parallel. So we have, a chrome card oh it's a good one very nice these are so sick absolutely love these nice show hey it's honey these are sick so it is 92. Like that. i knew that i knew 92. <laughs> absolutely beautiful man Love these cards. I just really like the design of 92. I've said it before. Uh, this looks so good. And then they have a chrome refractor. What a banger. Love that card there. 
Nick Castellanos. Oh, Boba Shet. Black gold. That is sweet. Nice little addition here. Oh, God. Eww. That is not how you want to be handling these things. Straight up fumble right there. Very nice. Doing that. So I like the nice addition. This is a good set, man. I'm liking Update 2021. Bryce Harper, Jazz Chisholm, rookie Bobby Dalvik. That's a nice one. Rookie Mike Trout. That's my second Trout. I always put Trout off to the side, man. I'm going to hold on to that. Keegan Thompson, rookie. Santos, rookie. Honeywell, rookie. Garcia rookie. And another Garcia rookie for the Tigers as well. They got two rookie pitchers there. Garcia. Uh, that car. Another rookie pitcher. Whoa. Rookie combos. I have not seen this. Is that? It was like that came out of nowhere. Rookie combos. Interesting. So they're rookies. So that goes over here, I guess, with the rookies. Interesting, I, that's my first time seeing a split card from Flagship. Uh, Manoa, rookie. A debut of Trammell, Taylor Trammell. Man. Aaron Hicks. Let's see if we can get any more rookies here on the back end. Definitely have slowed down. The rookies. Nice one here, Seth Romero. And the last card is a rookie of Peter Solomon. So look at that stack, man. Jeez. We'll add our uh, parallels on top of that. Take a look at some keepers. Another Andrew Vaughn debut, Akil Badu. Nice numbered card there, Jonathan India. Nice number card to 499. It's a rookie. Andrew Vaughn. Brian Hayes. So a lot of really good stuff, man. These hangers are solid. Um, especially if you can get them at a really good price. I don't know how much they're gonna be at Target or at Walmart. Um, this show hey, is so sick, man. I love these. And then this is really cool, this black gold bow bichette. Um, if you can get it for 999. I think they're a win. I think they're a good buy. Some solid rookies, some debuts, some interesting subsets in here. The chromes look great. I like it. I don't know. I might I might be tempted to grab a few more just to try them out. Definitely want to try some more formats here on the channel, though. So keep an eye out for that. Coming very soon. Appreciate you guys watching. Please feel free to like, comment, and subscribe. And I will see you guys on the next video. Peace.